Tonight, a 13 year old boy is dead following a shooting near an Atlanta skating rink. This is Deshaun DuBose. Police say he was shot multiple times along Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard late Saturday night near the Cascade family skating rink. Now he was a student at Drew Charter School and earlier today, a grassroots organization camped out near the site of the shooting to pass out free gun locks for parents. When Deshaun left home, his mother, his father, our grandparents, look forward for him being able to come back home where he didn't make it back home. In the last two hours, we heard from Deshaun's mother, Charlotte DuBose, as she is just beginning the process of grieving the loss of her child. Hey, I'm hurt. It's a hard pill to swallow. And I took the life of my son. We will hear much more from that grieving mother tonight on 11 Alive News at 11. And unfortunately, recently we have had to report on several acts of violence involving children across Metro Atlanta and Atlanta city leaders are trying to put a stop to it. Yeah, they really are. So they're considering a revised curfew. So city council member Keisha Waits is among those supporting a curfew for children under the age of 16. Now children would have to be with an adult after 8 p.m. during the week, 9 p.m. on Fridays and Saturdays. Council member Waits first introduced this measure after 12 year old Zion Charles was shot and killed near Atlantic Station in November. Zion's mother, Derricka Charles, shared her support during an Atlanta Public Safety Committee uh, committee meeting this afternoon. Is this the new normal? Waking up seeing kids on the news every day. I, I thought Zion was an example for somebody else's parent, but maybe Zion's story didn't hit nobody else. Cause, so can y'all please just start by doing that curfew? It would mean a lot. So the proposal has not passed the full council just yet.